hello guys so today I'm just gonna do a quick video right here so I encountered a little problem my Habu Super Sport or SS like it says right there um, so the wing is all mangled up uh, that piece is missing it's cracked all along here uh, you, you can see a couple of repairs right there and whatnot so I wanted to get a new wing but to my surprise everywhere I try to go um, that they sell Horizon Hobby products uh, and parts, uh, the Habu SS wing is uh, non-existent essentially. It's all in back order and they just don't have it in stock right now. They won't even let you purchase it. So the other thing that I've noticed is in the Habu STS version, uh, the wing, well on the manual, the dimensions of the plane overall are the same. So I thought, well, maybe they're interchangeable. So, if you look at this, they look pretty much the same, right? Well, here's a hack. They are the same. The only difference and the only reason why they are different part number is because that is silver and that's red. That's literally the only difference. You can see how it says Horizon Hobby right there in the corner. And that is the only difference. So, those parts are interchangeable. In fact... The STS version of the wing, which is red and silver, not yellow and, and gray, or silver, uh, is actually cheaper than the, ST, than the SS version of the wing. Yes, it will come with no decals on it, like this one has the, uh, the snake on it and everything, and SS, Habo SS, and all that stuff. It will come with no decals whatsoever. It will come with no electronics whatsoever. So you will have to keep your old wing to move... Uh, the servos over and the landing gear and everything that comes from the middle of it so this wing is basically just foam and I like, kept a couple of plastic pieces on here because they're broken anyway so I'm gonna get rid of them but yeah there you go guys uh, you don't have to replace everything I actually kept the back of it uh, because it's basically intact it's got a little damage up there but flies straight flies good uh, and I just replaced the main wing onto the fuselage of the Habu SS. So there you go. That's a uh, life hack for you. And I hope you guys enjoyed it and that you learned something from this. And actually, I was on the chat with the E-Flight people talking about the wing. Uh, whether it's the Habu SS or whether it's the Habu STS uh, wing or fuselage or plane in general. And what they were telling me is that, well, they would not recommend because the wings are different. Well, let me tell you something. Like I've already stated a million times, everything is bolt on, just stock, as is. Nothing changes, no modifications whatsoever. Everything bolts on. It comes with the stickers that go to cover the servos. Uh, it, it comes with the servo covers. Uh... Yeah, it basically comes with everything. It comes with that little intake in, in the middle of the screen. Uh, and yeah, it basically comes with everything that you need to be set for good. And get your plane back up in the air. So, uh, also the fuselage, the fuselage, the intake of the STS is a little different. But, uh, that's besides the point. If you break the wing... You can replace it with the SDS. It's a different uh, part number because of the colors, but that's the only difference. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Bye.